We're about to um, head on to Bribe Island. Going over the bridge. So it's me and Danny and Danny, and we're gonna go and look for some um, hop chops. Let's get some bridge footage, I guess. Yeah, let's go. Hello, Bribe. Looks nice. There was a time I used to think of this as my island. Yeah. Hey guys, this is that first stop of the day. Me and Dan gonna have a look. We probably won't record in there, there's too many people. It's a very famous scene. Oh yeah. So that would be just nobody's signature. Mm. Uh, Chinese brush hardware. That one person did the sky, one person did the horse, one person did this. They would just line up. Mm. And it's paint a bit, paint a bit, paint a bit. Paint a bit, paint a bit. That moves all conveyor belt. Hmm. It's quite, it's almost, that's how it's that. Yeah, I've seen that. Sterling silver. Mm. Tinkerbell. Is there anything you want to look at in particular? Yeah, there is actually. Can I have a look at Tinkerbell there? Yeah. Just, um, top one. Sterling silver, right at the front. No, keep going. Keep coming right at the front. Sterling silver, right at the front. That's it. You did it. That's oh, a bridge. Looks like Tinkerbell. It is oh, yeah, Tinkerbell. it's a Disney. It is Tinker. Yeah. <laughs> Cash, eh? <laughs> She's in Sterling, so let's see what the world is. Yeah. If it's 95, we actually do look at the so. Yeah, it says it on it, so. I'm just trying to find it in the market. Oh, we won't put it on unless it's there. The fines. Oh, the fines, okay. Well, this is what I got from this one. This is lovely. It's a little bit of citron. Silver citron sea Oh, glass. it's just glass, yeah. I don't know why it's a citron. But I like it. It was three bucks. Yeah. These here, price. I don't know if they're anything. But this here, this here so it's also much Jam 52, plus 375. Now gold is 30 bucks for nine grams, and I just, for a gram. And I think that mm. weighs more than three grams. Oh, true. So I think the gold value alone, mm. I didn't bring my scales. Guys, we're at um, op shop number two. We scored some gold at the first one. I hope we did all right, because I didn't bring the scales. Much here, move along. Small shop, though. Mm. A lot of people in there. Small shop, though. Yeah. Number three, again and again, up shop. Yeah, hi, Richard. Doing a second hand shop, okay? I'm driving on the table. Yeah, I'm just hunting. Yeah. Which house have we got? We've got a nice abyss. Oh, that's cool. Three, three bucks in on that. Everything's half pricey. What about your pops? What do you got on them? Uh, six dollars. So is that half price? Uh, well, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, 12, Hey guys, we're just going to where? Um, we made it, showing you there's like three or four shops along here. So, um, what's interesting? This one looks dark and mysterious in here. Oh no, the, the US opens on, so. Are you watching tennis? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm watching the tennis. <laughs> Thanks, yeah, yeah. Do not uh, interrupt. Shelton and um, Tia. <laughs> And, and so sorry, around, if you need any help, yep. I oh, may get up and help uh, interrupt you. Awesome. I may not as well. During change of ends or something. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Tennis mm. is very important. It is. Yes. I'm taking I my seven year old I remember those this afternoon right. for lessons. Yeah, that's it. 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 Yeah, Wow. 
This is amazing. Yeah. Because cool. it looks so small at the front of the shop, and then you come out here. And it's bloody huge. Mm. Oh. Storage containers. What a great shop. What's that price like? Yeah, they're like higher than an off shop, but still kind of reasonable. Look at this. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. And um, you're very lucky to. This is where you want to find Pokemon cards. Because <laughs> you probably doesn't know about Pokemon cards. They'd be bowls. Well, that's a cool book, History of Firearms. Oh, Four. by the NRA, National Rifle Association. That's why 45, 45 on it. Yeah, she, so it's she like you buy it prices, down. yeah. Yeah, definitely. She would have looked it up. Uh, the pottery, like, like how you know the pottery as well. It's how she makes money. People chop things to break and we've got to break them. <laughs> Is that Chewbacca? Oh, yeah. That is cool. <laughs> 20 bucks. Chewy! What year? Luca oh, it's a Lucas film, at least. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I suppose now it doesn't say Lucas, does it? Yeah, yeah, nah, it's all Disney. Any new stuff. Oh, look at all those nice bottles. They come through the light. And yeah, it's good on the glass. Sure right? Hey guys, we're just going into another one. We just met Mary down there. Melt all down like a big pot or something. Yeah. Good pricing. You guys busy fingers. Busy fingers, right? I'm like, it's like pretending I'm texting. Yeah. It makes it easier oh. to film. So it's like for bathing, like infants and it. We're buying it. You're going to buy it? We're buying it. Yeah. If I don't want to put it anywhere else. We haven't shown you yet when we get back. Me and Dan are gonna have a beer. Have a look at the ship we got. I mean quality merchandise. The Ningi Bay roadside store thing. I got a big W pop top. Hey guys, we're back from our adventure on Dubrai Beyond. Um, Dan's done all the videoing today. It's something different we're trying. Dan's there behind you. 
I'm going to show you the finds we got today. We've got a couple of other things afterwards that we couldn't go into. So let's have a look. Um, in order of us getting them, we got this stuff first, not that. So we got some jewellery. You've seen that? I haven't actually looked at them yet. Two bucks for them. Looks like, looks like jar. I don't know if that's anything. This is just glass with silver. It's a gold ring. So I paid up for this ring, but it's stamped 925 and it's, I think it weighs about 3.2. I can't find my bloody scales. It's at 120 on it. Now I know with Lifeline they have like a discount thing for $20 off if you buy more than the $200 worth of stuff, right? So generally anything at Lifeline you're gonna buy over $100 mark, feel safe in offering them $20 less, even though it's a charity, you're not offending them because they give that as a discount to the regular customers mm. anyway. So it's a good idea for Lifeline. Mm. That's here, that's here in Queensland. I don't know about the rest of Australia, but Queensland we do that. Um, then, um, I think the next one was these. We went to a few when you get anything. Uh, yep, oh, yeah, oh shit. <laughs> Sorry. And uh, said, so Dan got this one. Good score, Dan. Thank you. That's pretty cool. Yeah. That's what we want. It's got a tag there. So it's not the real, you know, the real, real expensive one, but is it? Oh shit, it's quality, Dan. Mm. If I don't fucking break it. <laughs> yeah. But it's quality, it's a good cotton shirt, you can feel it. I've got the abyss here. Special deluxe, just let me put this jewelry away. Yeah. It's about to freaking blow everywhere. And um the Bish collection. So this this second hand store was closing down. Um sad really, but here, here they close it down. Uh, the Abyss Special Edition had three bucks on it. Uh, but he said it was 50 cents anyway. So it's a disc. Nothing great. It's probably 10 bucks. I didn't know that was VHS. That's cool. Yeah, it's a VHS. Mm. Now, this here, Chicken Park. Now, when I first saw it, it's another one of Dan's finds. Oh, it's Jurassic Park. I went, yeah, okay, Jurassic Park. He gets it back in and says, no, it's Chicken Park. So it's different again. Older one. Not bad, Nick. With these, you'll see if you've got any mold on it. No, mold free. That's about all I know about VHSs. Obviously, the horror ones are the other shit. Horror ones, big box, been hired out before, which like, this one looks like it has. It's got a number on it. Um, so, Dan was looking at comms on this. And there was one for sale for how much, Dan? It was it won, crazy. Yeah, 190. 190 bucks. X rental one. X stickers. rental, yeah, which this one is. Yeah, it's yeah. It's got the tag on yeah. it. Yeah. I mean, that's not a sold comm. Yeah, not a sold comm. But. Yeah. It's only better than 50, 50 cents, isn't it? Mm. Now, the find of the day I like is this big, big bowl. Again, paid up for it, paid 100 bucks. We've got the soul ticket on it, but underneath here, it's got what we paid for it. So, we got this from a place called Busy Fingers, which is on Bribey Island. Barney's Bath Bowl, they don't know what it is. Very beautiful, 5th of the 9th. So this came into their store yesterday. I love these places where they put dates on when it comes in because you go, ooh, that doesn't mean that long. Like if they turn around and said 6th to the 7th, I go, well, shit, that's nothing. Because there's been a hundred dogs on there hunting for rock, rock bones, you know what I mean? That long. But as that's that, you're like, whoa, we might have got some. It's all mother and pearl laid here. It's got a bit of damage and repair here, which makes me think it's got age. All right, now this stuff really hard to date. Really hard to date. It's heavier than what like a normal piece would be. If it was just touristy. It just looks right. The patina looks right. Looks like it's got some age. I think we might have something here, Dan. I don't know. But we're gonna bung it on eBay. Maybe we'll put a thousand bucks on it and see what the world says. That's what I think. Something like that you do. Now the last stop we went, which was a little roadside thing. Um, it's like a little shop that we couldn't video. So a little Nintendo Zelda case. So I paid two bucks for this. Nothing in it, little case. This is a, a PSP. No cords, no nothing. I don't know if it works. It's got the battery in there. I open that up and I, I don't even know how to open the rest of the other part. I think it's got a disc in it. Oh, cool. What's that? Gods of War. Oh, cool. Chains of Olympus. Oh, that's cool. It's a popular title. I didn't even know how to open that. Um, and a Nintendo. Five bucks this one, five bucks this one. I don't know what this is. It's like a little, it's a DS. Oh, yeah, Nintendo DS. Yeah. But it's big, isn't it? It's not like I know DS. Is that? It's a bit broken there. 
But you see these handholds for five bucks, you freaking buy them. You don't muck about, it's got no good, don't care. Online, even if they don't work, even if I say don't know, parts only, still gonna make 30 bucks. And that was probably gonna make 40 bucks looking at the comms. Hmm. So, oh, this one here we got two. From this place we got this bowl. Have a look in there, it's a Geelong Cats, which is an AFL team, Australian Rules football team here in Australia. Go to Catters. I'm a crow supporter actually, but if I see any AFL stuff, I've just got, you know, got a soft heart for them. So that's all we got, guys. I'm sorry to say that is our lot today. So love shiz, and we'll see you on the next thing. Thanks, Dan. Let's see how it goes, eh, brother? Yeah, mate. Thank yes. you.